Hey, make sure y'all drop a like and a sub for me showing the jump shots in the beginning. Make sure y'all watch this full video. I'm gonna show y'all the best badge loadout for every type of build along with these um amazing green jump shots and a bunch of shooting tips, man. It's the ISO guy, Sensei. The greatest nigga on 2K in existence. And look, man, this jump shot right here, I know it looks crazy, okay? It has a huge green window, okay? If you are like a bot, you can't afford certain jump shots, low three-point rating, whatever. Um, You see the requirements, like mid-range 73, 3.73. The jump shot has a huge green window, right? Um, For some reason, people think timing impact is the green window. This is not true. It, it helps your green window widen, but it's really dependent on the base, first of all, and then the timing impact. And then they say it's like 5% uh, only extra. So timing impact isn't that important, but um, it does help. They say like 5%. I don't know, but this is a good jump shot. Y'all probably haven't seen this. It's a good jump shot for spot ups, you know, maybe bigger guards, you know, try it out. Let me know what you think. Hey. Here go amazing jump shot, man. Young Precise put this on Twitter, man. He says, if you are a small guard, definitely try this out, man. He is a comp pro-am player. Y'all let me know if this jump shot is calm, okay? He don't even post jump shot videos, so you won't even get it on his channel, man. And also, if I don't show certain jump shots, it's because I've already showed them in another jump shot video. I'm dropping a bunch of jump shots for y'all so they're probably in other videos so don't be weird in the comments y'all let me know what jumper y'all use down below and help everyone else down below what you have found success with and um yeah by the way i use very late for my release timing y'all let me know what y'all use down below too um kyle kuzma this might be my main jumper i might switch to this i've been using o'shea recently and um i might switch to this man this is a little faster y'all try this out it's a very good jumper man for main guard build you can even use it for you know smaller builds too now this is um set shot 25 it's not as glitchy fast as last year this is the only one i can see that looks like set shot 25 y'all let me know what other jump shot is set shot 25 because shouldn't set shot 25 be uh super fast you can't make it no fast i haven't tested this but this is just set shots if y'all want it you know it dominated last year here is another great jump shot as you can see man now look here's what you could do with it you could do you know straight pure oscar or you could leave it like this okay you know nice green window you can use it for your guards your bigger builds you know by the way a lot of y'all man you'd be like yo why can't i find this jump shot it's because you don't meet the requirements okay you got to meet the requirements here's a nice spot up jump shot y'all could try this hoe out this would be the, like the best version a lot of y'all can't get this oscar robinson release but if you can you know this is something you should invest in man. even if y'all can't use my releases you know that base is fire so keep that in mind you know just try to find the best releases for the jump shot I like very late shot timing, man. Now look, before we get into the badges, man, y'all are gonna make wanna make sure that y'all actually do this. It helps you get uh 25% less on um Gatorade. And then if you wanna shoot better, you need Gatorade, bro. It just helps you out, bro. Overall, if you got the money, I mean I don't recommend it, bro. This 2K shit is just ass. If you're a guard, you know you need it more than other people. I mean, you could just go with like one. <clears throat> y'all let me know y'all success rate on like certain gatorades man but it's sad but I, i'm just giving y'all the tips you know sometimes y'all gonna do anything to win if you're in competitive environment you kind of got to or you're kind of gonna be at a disadvantage and then also skill boost man y'all look y'all let me know y'all want the glitch <laughs> skill boost will help you out tremendously man it's, it's sad to say but it's just how they got the game monopolized man now i'm gonna show you the badges okay look here are the best shooting badges in general, bro. Okay, I don't have my shooting max on this build, but I'm gonna just show y'all something. Agent 3s is the best badge for main ball handlers, okay? The best badge, okay, bar none. It's not just fading. It's not just pull-ups, bro. It's stopping a uh, pop. It's everything. Every shot you take while like moving rhythm shooter, it's all combined into this badge. So if you are a main ball handler, put this shit on max, bar none, bro. 
okay? Um, even catch and shoot, when you're a main ball handler, you want this, bro, because you can shoot it instantly. And like, even with the fade shot, your catch and shoot's gonna pop up and the agent threes, and then you could catch them hoes even more. Everyone is leaving everyone open, bro. Okay, like all levels, bro. Like especially when they think you're like drained of adrenaline and all that. Catch and shoot, it, it changes your game completely, bro. Especially if you are bad, bro. Uh, amped, you know. Eh, you know they they say it reduces the penalty. It, it's it's cool, bro. Um, and then Claymore, when you spot when when you're spotting up, you catch the ball and you wait and then you shoot. This is more for spot ups. But still, this is still a good thing for a main ball handler. You see, I got it low. And then the volume shooter, I'm going to eventually max out because, you know, it helps with every shot. But limitless range, you don't even need, bro, because of the limitless takeover. I'm going to show you, bro. Look, I can keep shooting from half court with this badge, with the uh, with the damn near seven, seven, what, what was my three point? Like a 76-3, bro. I can shoot from half court just with this badge on single. Like the single takeover. And you can shoot from everywhere. So you can save badge points without um, even having limitless on. You know, it's still a good badge. It's, it works. It's, it's a great badge. But if you have like accelerator and just limitless, you can just hit from limitless. So you can save badge points and be smart. I got a bunch of clips, bro, of uh, me hitting from Limitless. The Dead Eye, uh, you know, it, it ain't, it ain't that, it ain't, it ain't what it used to be. Blinder, same thing. Corner, they say don't work. Some people say it do work. Green Machine, they say it activate after the third shot until I hear otherwise. So it's not really as needed. Guard up. Some people say don't even work. Um, Space Creator, all dependent to your style and mini. But yeah. Your main badges that you want as a main ball handler, Agent 3's amped, catch and shoot. And then you start to, you know, the volume shooter, then the Claymore, and then everything else is all dependent on you. Now for a spot up, bro. You want catch and shoot max, Claymore max. I don't, I, I'm not, I'm not too, I don't, I don't, I don't know about guard up, bro. For a spot up, you could do something like this, bro. Really, for a spot up, it's really like the same badges, bro. It, it really is, because they say uh, corner specialists don't work. It's really like the same badges, man, to be honest. Now, maybe, uh, I don't know about this dead eye and blinders, bro. I don't know, bro. I, I haven't been made a believer. A lot of people make a lot of tweets and stuff, but I, I, I just haven't seen it. You can shoot crabs. People think it's blinders. You can shoot crabs without blinders and it be op like i don't think people are noticing a big difference from making it gold to uh you know i don't know bro basically between spot ups and um main ball handlers is you're just going to want to have clay more and catch and shoot more that's basically it bro to to keep it a hundred and of course these are going to be your main shit you know the catch and shoot and the claymore but you want to be able to fade and sometimes the game makes you fade so you want to have this badge on still this will be your third badge as a spot up that you will need and um y'all yeah. be sure to follow me on twitch man link is in the description make sure y'all go to the gym eight days a week drink a gallon of water a day and click on one of these two videos but hey hey here we go again yeah again people talking this but when this hit the fan everything i'm at made me now break it down yo off the top of the dome dome